I am from Houston, Texas, H-Town. So grew up in Houston, Texas my whole life um, with my seven siblings. Seven, yeah, seven, so. I'm number six of eight, so I'm on the lower half. Uh, so you can imagine a lot of torturing me growing up, growing up with a big family. Oh man, I can't tell you how awesome my mom is, man. I mean, eight kids, all homeschooled. Man, I, I can't, I can't, I don't know how she did it because I have a hard time keeping it up and she does stuff myself, let alone eight kids. So, so she's pretty awesome for sure. I grew a fascination for, engin fascination for engineering um, at about 13 years old when I got to go to the JSC for the first time, which is where my brother worked. And we got to see this thing called the Argo system. And I was like, yo, I think I wanna try something like that. When you grow up and you're working with Legos and you try to make these parts and such like that and, and, and dream about you know, going to the moon or going to Mars or flying out of space. And then I come to work every day, I'm like, man, I. I'm making stuff that's going to the moon. Like, it's incredible. I, 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 can't comp I can't comprehend the fact that I get to make stuff that's going to the moon. Like, me, Cyrus, it's, it's, pretty, it's pretty sweet. I take very, very serious what I do in my work and I wanna be diligent and, uh, and, 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 and grow my expertise in anything that I do. So I take value in, in, in hard work, and so to see that paid off with uh, with a job offer, I mean you can't you can't complain about that. My oldest brother, he works at NASA, and he still works at NASA, but uh, he hasn't been to the moon yet. So I get to have those bragging rights and say, hey man, I'm, I'm getting to the moon before you, so you can take that PhD. <laughs> I'm going to be on the moon.